into it as we're now joined on the phone by the head coach for the Washington Patriots softball team, head coach Amanda Orkoski. How are you doing today, Coach Orkoski? Oh, doing great. Excited. Uh, excited that the season started, and it's a beautiful day for a ball game. And that it is, as we'll be there tonight at Jefferson as you guys take on the Cougars. And uh, last year, from what we understand, it was a really good sectional series, <laughs> and obviously your team is hoping to get on the better end this year. Yeah, we're excited. Uh, you know, we we always say every year is a new year, so we're excited to uh, to start the year and and show you know who we are out there. So thank you for uh, giving the opportunity of, of letting everybody else see as well. Hey, coach, this is Nick Verzellini. Uh, your team last season, like we said, it was, a, it was a good season, even though you came up a little bit short there in the sectionals. Uh, who are you excited to see uh, from this year, and who should uh, people be looking out for in terms of who's going to make a big impact? Uh, you know, I'm excited all the way. You know, we're 15 strong. I know it's a lot of players. Um, they're they're making it tough for us as a coaching staff, and, and we're having to plug and play um, because they're all working so hard. Um, they're all hungry to get back to, as you said, you know, they had the, the chase last year. Um, you know, we give props to Jefferson for bringing them back home to the, to the county. Um, but, of course, uh, we'd like to do that as well. Coach Horkowski, with last year's season and now a good, great start to this year's season, what were some things during the off season that you guys were trying to build off? I'm um, really just working on the, the small stuff and working on becoming, a, you know, a good, solid team, one team all together. Um, you know, filling any holes that we had. We, we lost two great seniors last year. Um, but the great news is we only lost two great seniors. Um, so we've had a lot of great people step up. Um, they worked really hard in the off season, both with us as a, as a team and, you know, travel teams and on their own. Um, so definitely excited to show off the, the hard work that they've done. You guys opened up conference play with a nine to one victory over Musselman on Tuesday. Uh, Ruffner was in the circle for you. Is, is she kind of your ace in the circle this year? Yeah, we've got, uh, she's a, she's a great pitcher for us. You know, obviously being a senior, she's got that great senior leadership. Um, she, she's signed with Shepard. We're not ready to let her go yet. Um, so looking forward to, to a great last year with her. And then we've also got, um, uh, we've also got a great staff. We've got four pitchers total. Um, so we are pretty deep with that. And we've got, uh, two pitching, uh, college, former college pitchers, um, on our coaching staff. So it's really, helping us get that depth at the pitching position. Coach, uh, Jefferson tonight, we've talked about it being a big game um, for your team. Anytime a team uh, ends your season, do you, does that add a little extra uh, chip on your shoulder heading into this one tonight? Uh, you know, I, t I try to, to keep them kind of level with, you know, every game's a game, um, and that's how we try to play it. Um, we, we don't try to hype anything up. We don't try to downplay anything. Um, really, we, we want to go out and enjoy the great game of softball that, that it is. Um, enjoy the opportunity to play with each other. You know, we get to play. Um, like I said in the beginning, it's a beautiful day, um, and we're definitely excited to get out there. Have you uh, determined who will be your starting pitcher for tonight? Uh, I'm going I'm to keep you guys on. Uh, I'll keep you guys surprised, and I'll let you see that tonight. <laughs> That's fine. And looking at your schedule this season, what are some teams that are going to challenge you down the stretch of the season? Uh, well, you know, of course, Jefferson, um, we expect them to bring it. Uh, Musselman's a great team. Hedgesville we haven't seen yet. Um, you know, being early, we're not sure who has what. Um, so, again, we're just taking it one game at a time, one practice at a time. Um, and the great thing that, that's different with high school balls and travel ball is Really, every game's practice because the only ones that really matter are when we come down to that uh, the games in May. So, I'm um, looking at it that way. Coach, we've talked a lot about uh, pitching, but what can we expect to see from your lineup this year? Um, hopefully, solid from the top to the bottom, right? That's what everybody hopes. <laughs> um, you know, looking to really string things together. I think that's one thing that we struggled with last year is getting the ball to, in play, um, getting those runners around the bases um, because. It really is a simple game. You just got to score more than the other team. Um, so it's really just putting all those little pieces together um, and figuring out what um, position everybody can bat in. Um, if somebody's struggling for the night, we don't mind subbing somebody in because, again, um, I really do have faith in that and the bench as well as our starters. What are some goals for the season that you guys have set in place? Um, really just starting as a team, um, ending as a team, and keeping that high energy from the start to the end. 
um, not getting wavy. You know, one thing that really took us out um, is we put ourselves in a hole last year. Um, that first game with, with Jefferson here, um, it, it made it tough to come back. You know, obviously we saw those two games were tough. Um, we gave it a run. Um, but really just not putting ourselves in a hole, um, starting up top, uh, making sure we don't drop in the middle and then finishing strong. Those goals sound pretty similar to what would be keys for success for tonight's game. Is there anything else that you want to add to that potentially for tonight's game? Uh, no, we're just excited. we got to, like I said, not hype it up, not downplay it, um, and just play our game like we, or like we know how to. We're uh, excited to see um, how they do, how we do, and, and like I said, hopefully put on a good show for everybody like Coach. we have in the past. <laughs> Coach, thanks for the time, and we'll see you tonight. 